Hey everyone, today I have the Nibiru Sport. It's a professional ping pong kit for four players. Let's get right into it. So right off the bat, it comes with a nice handy travel bag. It's got a nice stitched on handle. Um, it's got a zip compartment here that goes around all the way to the back. Let's get it, let's get right into it. Ways. Let's see what comes inside the kit. So here's this little tag, professional quality ping pong paddle set for four players with a net. Very interesting. Okay. So let's check off the rackets. Okay. So the rackets, the ping pong uh, paddles, sorry, not rackets there. It's got a nice protective clear film over it. That's always a good sign that they have attention to detail. Uh, the front and back are covered. And the sides are with a nice uh, finish. Handles are feeling pretty comfortable. Um, most standard grips, it's looking pretty good. Very soft, but also feels solid and rugged enough. It's not too heavy. Uh, it feels pretty good. So we have four of those. Okay, this is the same handle. And I think they changed the color of the handle on two of them. Okay, so this one, the color of the handle is slightly different on these. Uh, bottom two handles that we have, the last two handles. We have these two, black and blue, and orange and black. Cool, easy team distinction, very nice. Set those aside. Little looks forward, okay. And gotta check out the ping pong balls. So here they've given us three of the orange, easy to see ping pong balls. And of course, our standard tournament grade three star uh, white ping pong balls. So it's really nice that they've taken the time to give us these multiple options because based on the settings, it's always handy to have different ones. And what I see here, yeah, it's, they're, they feel just like, yeah, they're very good, high quality for sure. Their bounce is right. You can tell by the sound. That's usually about how it's supposed to sound. Um, and it's working well with the paddle, so I'm curious to see how this will fare out. So far it looks pretty promising, and now the net. Let's see what this net is about. Okay, so it's... This is an interesting kind of net. Okay, so it's retractable. Once you open it, I believe... Let's see where the opening latches. So you would push it down from here, from the top, the yellow compartment here is what extends it downward, and then you could clamp this to a table on the left side, and then you could clamp this on the right side, so. And then you have it stretching out all the way across for the entire size of the net, and it looks like a full-size net. Let's get a little closer and look at the net, and this seems like a pretty solid net, to, if I'm being honest with you. This, um, it's black and white, and it's got your standard, the build quality of the net seems it's pretty solid. It's very, it's very, it's well built. It doesn't look like it's going to rip very easily. And you can look by the twines that it's, uh, it's got double or triple twine lacing. So it's, it's a very solid net. So not something that's going to rip easily. And the mechanism to open and close this also appears very smooth. It's no, no restrictions. No, it's not jagged. It's not getting caught up with anything. Um, that's looking good, and I like the color and the accents to this, you know, it keeps it very playful, it's, it's nice. And I think this is what's really easy, traditional ping pong table nets have the, have your screw on there, there's a little screw that ties it on, but this one is really handy, it now it's just easily attach it and take it off. It's really nice if you want to just, uh, quickly play a game and then reset it and, you know, clear that space up for something else. But let's have a look and see how this setup works on the actual... Uh, ping pong table. So as we see here, this is the traditional uh, structure for the nets. You have it here, where it's latched on into place, and it's, it takes a little bit more time to unscrew it, and you have to take this set up, but you'll see how quickly it is with the Nibiru net. So here we have our net. I just removed the old net that was on the ping pong table. Let's go ahead and push the button, go all the way to the edge, and place it so it's nice and firm. Make sure that it's at the edge of the table to optimize your play space. And now it's really easy. I'm just gonna stretch it all the way out. And you're gonna wanna hit the other end of the table, like we see here. Keep going till you hit the end. 
Now repeat what we did earlier, press the yellow button down, place it, and you have a snap fit onto the ping pong table now. And as you can see, there's a little bit of excess rope, which is always really handy in case your ping pong table is of a different dimension, but we can run it. Let's see how it fares up with a ping pong. We have one ball. Pretty good. 